Hello. Your Amazon device is ready for setup. Just follow the instructions in your companion app. Very cool. So it's telling me that I need to get my app to set this up. So I might as well go ahead and start doing that. I have my phone. And I'm opening up my app. So you sign in with your Amazon account. So I'm going to do that off screen because I don't want you to see my password. So you can see the light ring has different colors, which is very cool. We'll figure out what all those colors mean in a little bit. Okay, and I'm now in with Amazon Echo. It's got my name. It's saying to connect to Wi-Fi, so I'm going to begin the setup. It tells me to put batteries in my remote. It says wait for the orange light ring, which we have, as you can see. And we continue, and then we're going to connect to the Wi-Fi. Actually, okay, it says go to your Wi-Fi settings on your phone and select the Amazon XXX network. So let me go to that and see if I need to do that. Okay. I'm not exactly sure how that's going to work with my normal Wi-Fi. You've connected to your device. Go, go ahead and complete the setup in your companion app. Pull my app back up. It's still waiting for the connection on the app even though it told me that we are connected. So it had me remove my normal Wi-Fi setting for home and connect to the Amazon Wi-Fi. So we'll see how that works once if it's just needed for setup or what we have to do. If I have to leave that on at all times, if this is like its own little router, I'm not exactly sure about that. It's still waiting for connection. So I'll probably pause for a second until it gets connected and then we'll start back up. Okay, still waiting for it to connect. So I decided to unplug it and replug it again and see if that is going to solve my problem. So I have the color light again and I have to wait for the orange light again to be able to continue with the setup so let's see now we have orange hello your Amazon device is ready for setup just follow the instructions in your companion app okay so she has a pleasant voice at least I'm going to continue on the app and it's saying connect your iPhone to Echo so that's the problem that I've been having so I'm going to head over to my Wi-Fi and reconnect to the Wi-Fi. Okay. You've connected to your device. Go ahead and complete the setup in your companion app. So hopefully it will let me do that now. So let's head back to the companion app. And we have that waiting for connection. Spinny timer of death. So there's like nothing that I can do except cancel the setup and don't see the orange light ring. Those are the only two links on this page right here that it gives me. So I think I have to wait for this to actually connect to this to be able to move on. Like if I hit the Echo Setup button up here, there's nothing. So put as close as possible. Let's see if that will help at all. So we are still waiting for a connection. So I think I'm going to go hit the help page on Amazon and see what they recommend because everything I've tried has not worked. So let me go check that out and I'll let you know how to solve this problem. Okay, I'm on try number three for setting up the Echo. So what I'm doing this time is I unplugged it, plugged it back in, killed the app. I'm going to try to connect to the Wi-Fi on the Echo before I put the app on and Hello. see if that helps. Your Amazon device is ready for setup. Just follow the instructions in your companion app. Okay, so the Amazon network is showing up on my phone already, so I'm going to select it. You've connected to your device. Go ahead and complete the setup in your companion app. Okay, so now I'm going to pull up the app and see if I don't get that spinning wheel of death here. 
So let's see. So I've also found out if it says your Echo app is offline, go to the home button here, click on settings, and then it has go to Echo setup. So that way I don't have to refresh the app or anything. So I'm at the orange light ring, so hopefully it will just automatically connect after I hit continue. Cross your fingers. And still have waiting for connection. Uh, the help section of Amazon is not really helpful at the moment. It just tells you how to connect to the Wi-Fi the same as the instructions here do. There's no forums yet because this is in such limited supply and I might be the only one having this problem so I might have to go start a forum or contact customer service if I can't get this to connect which is a bummer. Hmm. So I guess I'll wait and see if I get a connection again. I'll put it on pause again. Okay, we finally got the Echo connected to my phone. I had to talk to customer support, but they were very helpful, very um, patient while we tried to figure out what was wrong. And in the end, what we had to do, so if you have this problem where you're getting the waiting for connection and it's not connecting. We had to actually reset the Echo, so there's a little pinhole right there that you need a paper clip for. Hold it in there for five seconds, and then you're gonna get the blue light that goes around that you saw before. And then you're gonna hold down your action button for five seconds so you get the orange light again. And try, if that's not working, delete the app and then put the app back onto your phone and kind of follow those steps again. And that ended up connecting me, so now I'm all set. So, Alexa, what time is it? The time is 11.29. So we are all set to go. So I'm going to do some separate videos with some of the cool stuff that Alexa can do. And I will um, put this up for anybody that has any problems like I did. But if you have any other kind of problems, leave them in the comments below so that people can learn and kind of create our own little help section until uh, more people get the echo and are able to have kind of the forum going on Amazon.